So, this is the general structure of barbiturates and modifications could be made at 1st, 2nd, 3rd and 5th position. SAR of barbiturates will consist of following points. First is substitution at R1 and R2. Second is substitution at X. And the third is substitution at R3 and R4 that is at position 5th. So now, let us see substitution at R1 and R2. Generally, it is substituted with hydrogen or alkyl group. Alkyl group at the first position may have shorter onset and duration of action. Methyl group at first position may result in a barbiturates which is weak acid and therefore readily enters CNS. The best example for it is hexabarbital. So, this is the structure of hexabarbital which contains methyl group at first position. So now let us study about substitution of X. X could be substituted with oxygen or sulfur. Generally it is substituted with oxygen but substitution with sulfur makes barbiturates more lipid soluble and onset is fast with shorter duration of action. The example for this is thiopentone. This is the structure of thiopentone which contains sulfur at second position. Now, let us study about substitution of R3 and R4. Both R3 and R4 should not be substituted with hydrogen. Increasing the length of the alkyl chain at the position 5 may enhance the potency of the drug. Branched, cyclic or unsaturated chain produce shorter duration of action. Example is cyclobarbital and hexabarbital. So, this is the structure of cyclobarbital which does not contain hydrogen at 5th position but instead contains an alkyl chain and a cyclic compound. Now let us see about substitution at 4th and 6th position. Carbonyl group is essential for the activity and thus it is never substituted. Thank you. And if you have